Hmm. So we're a little bit into November now, aren't we? And um, at this point of the year is where I usually reflect on my list. Um, and before I get into that, I've decorated upstairs for Christmas. This is actually my tree, this blaring light right behind me. Uh, I couldn't hold back any longer. I have not decorated the big tree yet or downstairs or outside or anything like that. But upstairs has got some pretty lights. They're, they're fun, Christmassy goodness. Anyway, I have reflected on my list uh, a little bit. And as and I'll get more into this at the end of the year. Um, I'll go through my list again. And if you don't know about my list, uh, it's the reason this channel uh, came to be, is this year's list. Uh, and it's reasons behind some of the things have changed and the feeling I have towards some of the things have changed. Some of the things will happen. Some of the things that are left won't happen. Uh, whether that's uh, because of the way I feel about the uh, act or the, the goal or whatever you want to call it. Uh, the, way I f the way I feel about that thing has changed where it doesn't need to happen. Or maybe I didn't get the opportunity because a lot of them are about opportunity as, you know, taking advantage of an opportunity. And some of them are about not having an opportunity, you know. And then some of them are just me not doing it because I'm lame. Um, but I will get into that more at the end of the year. But right now, uh, I really want to end the year in these next two months the way I started it. Uh, as far as vlogging goes. And I really want to get into some of the things that happened to me this year. And some of the things that have changed for me. Some things I want to, you know, look at again. I want to look at some of the things that happened to me this year again. And, you know, think about how they changed me as a person. Or they changed the way I look at, you know, certain things in life. And a lot of that has changed. I mean... I have found my sister and my dad this year. That's a huge thing. And I got this great job. I've made some friends this year. And I've lost some friends this year. And I've reconnected with old friends, you know? And I've, I've grown stronger bonds with some people. And I've, I've made, like, new ideals in my life. And I've seen what I want for my future. And there's so many things that has happened to me this year good and bad. I mean, we went through hell this year with my granddad and he came out on the other side and he's so much better now and there's just so much stuff that happened this year. I just want to spend the next two months talking about it and the next two months reliving all the great things and reflecting on all everything that happened, good and bad, and I can't wait to do it. You know? And I can't wait to see what the rest of the year has in store for me. Because the parts of the year now that have passed have both been tremendously awesome and some of the worst times of my life. But I've gone through experiences this year that have changed me as a person, that have changed my ideals on what I want for my future, have changed the way that I look at myself. And... I smile more now than I ever have before, and sometimes I'm not so proud of the things I do or say or the way that I act, but there are times now where I see myself from like the outside and I look at myself and I see a person that I like. And this is the first time in so many years, I mean 10, 15 years, this is the first time I've looked at myself and liked what I saw. Have a great night. I'll talk to you later.